Hello everyone, and welcome into the incredible world of Pokemon Sword Shield. That's what I'm playing. <laughs> I don't remember what version of the game I bought. <laughs> oh, who are you? Welcome one and all to the wonderful world of Pokemon. This here is the Pokemon Shield Drunk Lock Challenge. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature beautiful cities, and many people with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. Thanks to help to these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us, in the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. Try and make that speech a little more dramatic with those arm movements, mister. Then again, it's sciencely spoken that apparently the more you move your arms, the more charismatic you sound. We call Pokemon! Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name is... Rose? Rose? We'll call him Rose. Now turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. Uh, his mother. Ah, I see you gone for the shorts and tights look. Very nice. I also rock those in my workout. That's what he's doing, right? Exhibition or not, it's your pristine record is about to end today. I don't care. You know I don't lose battles, Raihan. Charizard... Dynamo. That's a big boy. Okay. It is Pokemon Shield I'm playing. Uh, I don't remember what version of the game I bought. So this is the Pokemon Shield Drunk Lock. For those of you who don't know, it's a Mezlock with drinking rules. So I'll go over the basic rules with you in just a second. You know, it's the first po you have to catch the first Pokemon you run into in any given route. If you have to catch it, that route's dead, and you have to try to get the next route. I am doing great. Thanks, how are you doing? And of course, if your Pokemon are KO, they're considered dead, and you have to put them in the box or release them, never to use them again. Oh, that's your flash new... F that's your... F flash new phone? What kind of wording is that? Were you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? But you can't share him with him on your hands full. Yeah, you can't do that sweet s symbol that I think he totally ripped off from Jeff Hardy. Oh, it's a Charizard pose. I thought it was a Jeff Hardy pose. Well, I guess he puts his thumb out, and then Jeff does the J thing. You know, as you do. Come with me, Yuri. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits. So I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. Yes, I'm the blonde guy. Ooh. Absolutely adorable. Uh, wall, wall, and bag. But that hair, though. That's a camping bag if I ever saw one. Opening X save. Oh, by the way, I think it's fair to mention that I have not played Pokemon Shield as of yet. I'm going to this challenge completely blind. So let's say let's make the text fast. And we're gonna play this on set because switch is for noobs. And I'm not using items in battle because items in any kind of a Nuzlocke are OP. I've actually started a few Nuzlocks in the past, but never actually finished one. So this is my first Nuzlocke and I'm going in blind. Hey, I never said I was the smartest guy in the room. Hey mom, we match. 
Hop and Leon. Interesting names. So, and that's for the drinking rules. Anytime our Pokemon dies, we have to take a shot. I got my drink of choice right here. I'm covering the brand. I'm covering the brand. Just so you know, that starts with an S. And it's with a Miroff. And then I got my trusty little shot glass right here that I totally did not stick my fingers into. Big pull. At least you know you should hold anything that might bring you as big as a Snorlax. Oh, Lily, what's it doing here? It's using rollout. You'll get it one day. Hey, you silly Lulu. I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on that fencing. He's totally using rollout. No going past that fence, no. Everyone knows that there are scary Pokemon living in that slum... slumbering wield? Oh, like how you wield a sword and a shield. I get it. Now that's taken care of. How about it, Yuri? Let's race. I bet I can make it to my house first. What with you lugging around that big old bag? Oh, it's a beautiful lot. Uh, Butterfree. I know my Pokemon. But where do you live, uh, Hoppo? Is this your house? I should have guessed because those Wooloo were covering up the other route. Mom, is he here? There you are at last, Hop. Oh, and you brought along Yuri. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him cramped in the cupboard? He's still not here yet, for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you have to lose some patience. He's probably just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Alright, yeah, these new games tend to make you do all this talking before you actually get your first Pokemon. Come on, let me get my Pokemon so I can get this challenge started with. You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. You know, I've been doing pretty well while avoiding spoilers in this game. And I already know who the... Umbrella? Champion is. I guess they weren't really keeping the champion a secret, though. I mean, they pretty much tell you in the first 30 seconds, Yeah, this is the champion. This is the guy you're going to face at the end of the game. If you make it there. Let's get a move on. Only remember, Yuri. Wild Pokemon come out of nowhere if you walk through the tall grass. I got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Yuri. So let's do a clear of the tall grass as we go. You remind me of Barry. I don't like Barry. See? Barry like No wonder in the tall grass for you. Oh. Okay, you're smarter than Barry. I'll give you that. But you're giving me very Barry vibes. <gasps> it's him! 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 Still rocking the shorts and tight look, I see. I still call that the Jeff Hardy pose. Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for all of you to watch. It's our unbeatable champion. Leon, you and your Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope I can carry on training your Pokemon and never shy from battle. And come challenge me for the po champion title. They're really hammering home. This is the champion. This is the guy you're going to face. Charizard strong? Some people call him overrated. I wish for Gallus Chasers to work together and become the strongest in all the world. That is a short Charizard. Lee! My number one fan in the world has come out his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since I last saw you. Bingo! That's the sort that's the sort of sharp eye that kept you on the field for so long, eh, Lee? And these bright eyes over here. You I've got it, you must be Yuri. Am I right? 
I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion and a massive Charizard fan. Well, Leon, you and I have a lot in common then. I don't care if Charizard's overrated. Charizard's best Pokemon. I'm not saying the strongest Pokemon, but best Pokemon. He's number one in my heart. And that's all that matters. So we're just going to do that every time he... That's what he's doing, yeah. He totally just ditched me in his Charizard. He ditched... He left me with his ace. So you brought me or me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then. The greatest gift from the greatest champion. You're also humble. It's showtime, everyone. Uh, oh. You know? In their defense... I think I got my this my first Pokemon a lot quicker here than I did in Sun and Moon. Grokey, Score Bunny, and Sobble. I, don't know, I like all three of them. Oh, this is gonna be hard. Oh, I'm not picking you. Alright, line up everyone. I have no room for crybabies in my team. Which will you choose? So, I believe the way in a it's supposed to work in a Nuzlocke is that you're supposed to go by your trainer ID. If your trainer ID ends in a 1, 2, or 3, it's a grass. 4, 5, 6, it's fire. 789 is uh, the water one. And uh, zero is a wild, so you can pick whichever one you want. Can I see my trainer card, though? Uh, trainer card. Adventure guide. What's this? What's the adventure guide? Oh. Okay. And a fishing rod. Uh. No. I've already been playing this game for 21 minutes? I feel like I've barely done anything. Options. Nope. Okay, so I guess I'm not going to know what my uh, trainer ID is. So it's a wild card. Uh, let's see. Hmm. You know? In my... 20 plus years of playing Pokemon, I have learned that it's always super hard to come across any fire type Pokemon. So let's go with a uh, Score Bunny here. Score Bunny is a fire type. It's filled with <clears throat> filled to bursting with fiery passion. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, I've always been a fire guy anyway. And of course, as per Nuzlocke rules, I have to nickname this. So. It's a male. Okay. You know what? You know what? I just watched uh, night one of WrestleMania 37. So, in honor of what is, in my personally feel, a very good uh, celebrity involvement. I think you see where I'm going with this. If any of you guys are wrestling fans. Just make it something unique. All right, let's go, Bad Bunny. I like you already. So score Bunny, and of course you're gonna pick. Oh, you're not gonna pick the one that's weak against mine. Man, these rivals get dumber and dumber with every iteration. I think they did it on Generation Seven as well. I bet you will be, Hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Yuri. So the two of you can battle and grow and... Ch can battle and train and grow stronger together. To try and reach me. Sorry, Sobble. 
I have no room for crybabies. And you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but he's real strong and kind, too. Oh, so that's when I'll face it. Try your nonsense. Dinner's ready. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Oh. So I'm not gonna battle yet. Cool. So we have the healing effect, but I don't think we did any. No, we didn't do anything. The next day, you spent a whole lot of time with that new partner of yours last night, right, Hop? You two getting along all right? Understanding one another? You may have even built up a bit of love? Did a little dance? Of course I had, Lee. You already made fast friends with Score Bunny, too. Listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday, he might even become worthy rivals of me, the unbeatable and also humble champion. Humble. I can I can pronounce. What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who's been coming to you. If you think Yuri's going to be a challenge for you, then I guess he's my first rival. Oh. Sorry. My window's open and something just blinded me. Having Pokemon doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers race up battles. Oh, you think you're worthy of calling yourself a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in the battle against your friend, if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop in an honest first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Why not? Believe in your par partner Pokemon and care for them too, with all your heart. You do these two things, and I'm certain you'll choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling them. Is that his saying? Champion time? I've watched every match my brother's had. I've read every book. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just battle. Your brother's great. I get it. Whew. There we go. I got two... Two and one. This has got to be a first that I can think of where I'm facing a rival that has more Pokemon than me in the first battle. Usually it's one on one. Well, I guess in Generation 5 you had. Uh, in Generation 5 you had two battles back to back, but at least you had a chance to heal, though. Hmm. And one more. I can't switch even if I wanted to, so I'm not going to worry too much about damage output. Ooh. Okay. Okay, you're a physical attacker. Oh, I got a stab move now. It's not over yet. I added another trusty ally to my team. Uh, Grookey. No, that monkey's kind of adorable. You know what type of advantages, yada yada yada. Yes, I've been doing this for a long time. And Grookey feeds it. Hey guys, uh, sorry about that. I had to take a phone call. You know your Pokemon all fought hard. I just beat my rival on a two-on-one situation so that's cool you got real promise in fact i got a favor to ask of you be a rival to hop would you push him and make the both of you stronger i really want to get stronger and stronger you see me battle now so come on you can let me take on the pokemon gyms you join the gym challenge you think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the gallery region I'm not putting the chart before the rapidash here. The cart before the rapidash there, little brother. If that's really what you want to do, you do have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon, especially your friend Yuri. Before you think about getting gym badges, 
that's the thing about getting a Pokédex. The trainer's Pokédex helps them learn lots of things about all Pokémon out there, including their strengths. It's just more than a collection of data, you know, it's a trainer just love and passion for Pokémon training. Alright, let's get... Alright, now I guess we're on to get our Pokémon Dexes. Legend, you probably know, tell your mom. Alright, mommy, we're heading out. Up, oh, bush. Where am I going? Or, no, seriously, where am I? Oh, this way. Did you hear that just now? And the Wooloo was there. The Wooloo kept rolling, 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 rolling. I uh, cut her to awful, what do you say? I don't know, we're not allowed to go in there. The trouble leads to me. You're totally a berry. You're just gonna completely ignore what everyone says, that that forest is super dangerous and don't go in there by going in there to save a wild Hulu. I'm assuming it's wild. By the way, that gate crash was super loud on my headphones. It legitimately almost gave me a jump scare. <laughs> All right. Okay, there's our regional rodent. I don't have any Pokeballs, do I? No, so, okay. Nuzlocke hasn't officially started. At least not the uh, catching challenge. Two took it out. Perfect. If that was a crit. Okay. Oh. What was I doing there? So. Okay, so I can get the Pokemon game. They just run into the grass and you'll eventually run into a Pokemon. Okay. You receive berries. Joke's on you, I have no berries. Okay. That thing definitely will go down to a crit. That's okay. And one more tackle. Rookie D. Oh, like a Chica D. I get it. Sorry, I always try to figure out what they're punning off of. As a lover of puns. Uh, oh. What was that? Yeah, I know, but what Pokemon was it? I was anywhere near that one. I swear, I keep thinking it's like a Pam Chan or something like that. And then the rest of his body shows up. Its tail is what looks like a Pam Chan. You know, I would think that with the move to the console, it would update some of these animations. But a lot of these animations seem to just be ripped off of a Sun and Shield and X and Y. Well, I guess if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Ah, well. One more tackle, how to do it. I know it's called tackle, but my bunny just seems to be kicking it. Okay. This way. Oh. Lulu might be in trouble. Oh, well, Pokemon might be mauling on it. Come on, move. There we go. Oh, it's. I can't see anything. Can't see. Oh, I guess we're going to run to that Pokemon now. Oh, there we go. Greed. What's your name? I guess we'll never know. Okay. Yeah, 
It's an illusion. Well, the move had no effect on it. Okay. Uh, so, uh, hop. You're not gonna help me? No? You're just gonna stand there? Cool. Yeah, I'm fine. Let me just do this move. It'll probably have no effect on it. Yeah, phase right through. It was an optical illusion. Man, it sounds like I'm underwater. This is so cool. It's all a dream. I forget how the rest of that song goes. Hop, Yuri. What? Lee, how did you manage to find your way here? Your pants with directions. You always get lost. Oh, 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 that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two and you never showed. Of course they came looking for you both. Wait, where's Lulu? Wooloo. We're trying to rescue that Wooloo. Maybe we were tackling the Wooloo the whole time. The little chap's just fine. Although you'll have me f fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds. Hop is a total berry. Don't go into Pokemon. Don't go into the tall grass and leave Pokemon. Let's go into the tall grass, pal. Nothing's gonna attack us. Seems a little stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It had the source presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really. They seem to pass right through it. Your moves pass right through it. So, the fearsome Pokemon they say will live in Sumbling Wield are actually illusions or something? Get strong enough, and maybe the two of you can be the ones to reveal the truth someday. For now, we'll simply get out of this place. You'll be all right now. <clears throat> all right now that I'm here with you. Well, that was an early legendary encounter. Oh, which Hurst. All right, now can I go tell my mom where we're going? I'd like to kind of get this Nuzlocke started with, or drunk lock. Mom's not here. There's mom. You just got her, buddy. He isn't just a sweetheart. And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedge Hurst, aren't you? Here we are, a bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center, some potions. Remember, Score Bunny will be able to battle at the very end. Don't, so don't go push yourself too hard on the poor deer. And you, Score Bunny, look after my little Yuri. Come here and rest any time that you need. After all, east, west, home is best. I wish my Pokemon would can follow me like in Heart Gold. Uh, maybe in a future game. They almost did it for uh, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. But, alas, did not happen. Go to the next champion. I guess I'll probably show Grookey a bit. You should get yourself to the building with a purple roof and the great red and white ball in the dark out front. It's a research lab. Well, what do I have in my bag right now? I keep going for start for my bag. I'm so used to always pressing start. There's my bag. Fishing rod. Oh. All right. I guess the Nuzlocke challenge officially begins. Let's get our first encounter. I always get one encounter, so I guess it'll be a you. You're the first one I saw. So Pokemon pop up, and you can find them grass. I guess I'll just go for the first one that I see. I guess. Let's see. One tackle. Should live one. All right. Okay, so one did about a quarter, so another one should bring it down to about half. Even with crits, it should be fine. There we go. 
power trip. Okay. That's fine. Two, three, click. Rookie D. All right. Nice. Very nice. Quick attack. Would you like to give Rookie D a nickname? Yes. Um... Uh, I'm not sure what type you are, but you give me this impression. So. Nightwing. All right. What's this? Potion. I'll need all you. I meant to do that. Oh well. I mean, I should be getting all the experience I can. I'm going to this blind, so I have no idea what level the first gym leader will be at. Oh. That is a bulky chipmunk. One more. Okay, so that'll be about a four hit KO. I'd say. What's this crits? Yeah, okay, it's four. Alright. That should be okay. I'm good. I'm good. Alrighty. Yeah, let's get let's go on our way to uh I'm just gonna Alright, oh, yeah. You can never be too careful. I don't think I'm gonna use Nightwing quite yet, so Okay. There's Oh, uh, did Leon ditch you again? The ultimate Charizard. You thought just Charizard's the ultimate Charizard. Leon, you gotta stop ditching your Charizard. See your Pokemon's grown. Thanks to all the Pokemon you have with you. I'm sure, you know, I'm sure I'm glad I got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now when we go. Professor Mangolia, Mag Magnolia, there we go, Magnolia. Bowrock. Aww. Look at the puppy. What is it today, Leon? Oh, hello. She's like a more mature M Misty. I dig it. Mwah. Totally something right now. <laughs> Yamper. Yamper, here's a real chant when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lots lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. Where's your brother, Manic? I like the way she cooks. She makes you gobble down food in the flat. A lady who likes to cook. Well then. What do we have to do? Challenge is just the amper helping you out. I did too. Yeah, I'm sure she made all those nice lunch boxes for you. This is Yuri. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Sam on the right path, would you? Yamper. Yeah, yeah, so adorable. Where's I think I had? Always got his head lost in the clouds. No wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh. Looks like you got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Rotom phones are handy little things. But man, look at that notch. It's like an iPhone. Man, it's a teardrop, so it's more like one of those... Like last year's Samsung phones. You bet. 
Well said. In that case, I'll make sure that you use that Pokédex on that Foam Rotom. Alright, I got the Pokédex. From my Gran, can you let Gran know that you received the Pokédex? She lives in the house down on Route 2. Yes, Sonia, I will let your grandmother know that I got your Pokédex in the next video. I'll see you all very soon. Bye-bye.